Hey guys, in today's video, I wanna talk about the next major update expected to be coming to the iPhone. Obviously, that should be iOS 17.6. Now, iOS 17.6 Beta 1 should be released here sooner rather than later. But in today's video, I wanted to share with you guys a preview of some of the features we could expect to come to the iPhone with the next major update. Now, keep in mind that a lot of these features and predictions will be based on previous features we've already seen Apple test in beta form, but never released officially, or features features we already know are found within the code of iOS and Apple has yet to enable them. So let's go ahead and dive right in. So the first feature I want to talk about is a feature found within the code of iOS, but Apple has yet to enable this one. And this one is called game mode. And now I was hoping for this one to be enabled within iOS 17.5. That did not happen. So hopefully with iOS 17.6, Apple will enable game mode for iOS. Now keep in mind, this is already a feature for the Mac, for Mac OS. And it was already found within the code of iOS that this feature is something that Apple is working on for the iPhone. If Apple does enable this feature, I think this is going to be specifically for the iPhone 15 and 15 Pro models, as it will require most likely the latest Apple chip in order to optimize that performance for better gaming on your iPhone. So I'm hoping to see game mode officially roll out to iOS 17 here in the near future, perhaps with iOS 17.6. So next I want to talk about SharePlay. We already have SharePlay for CarPlay. This allows you to share a QR code with others in the vehicle with their iPhone phones they can scan a QR code and control the music no matter where they're sitting or who's playing music within the radio right well this feature was being tested with HomePods and tvOS within iOS 17.4 betas but then later removed and scrapped altogether we haven't seen this feature hit the iPhone just yet but share play for HomePods and tvOS could make its way to the iPhone with iOS 17.6 and obviously HomePod OS 17.6 and tvOS 17.6 this is a really cool feature again you can allow others to scan this QR code and then they can control the music that's playing in the car. Well, this feature could be coming now to the HomePods and the Apple TV. So hopefully we'll see this one with 17.6. Now, next I want to talk about this really cool feature for Apple Music called Transfer Music from Other Services. Now, this feature was also previewed with iOS 17.4 betas, but then later removed from the iPhone and we haven't seen it again. Now, this feature aims to allow users to bring any music playlist or any music downloads from other services and import them directly to your Apple Music library. As you can see right here, you can transfer music from other services, add save music and playlists you made on other music services to your Apple Music library. Right there, you can click start and this will transfer your playlists and all your other music from other services directly to Apple Music. Awesome feature, previewed with iOS 17.4 betas, the later scrapped. Hopefully we'll see this one roll out within iOS 17.6. Now, last but not least, I want to talk about stopwatch live activity for the lock screen and a dynamic island for iOS 17.6. Now, this was a feature that was introduced with iOS 17.4. You can start a stopwatch, send it over to dynamic island, or have it as a live activity on your lock screen. But this feature was later removed within iOS 17.4 betas and did not make its way to the iPhone with iOS 17.5, unfortunately. So stopwatch live activity could be coming to the iPhone with iOS 17.6. Now, when it comes to release dates, the first beta for iOS 17.6 could happen any moment now. I'm thinking this week, we could see iOS 17.6 beta one as early as today or tomorrow, believe it or not, at the latest next week with an official release later in late June. We'll have to wait and see, but those are going to be some of the features we're hoping to see Apple bring to the iPhone with iOS 17.6. Let me know what you think about these in the comments down below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys real soon. Peace.